Hey guys, it's Damien from Marketing Food Online. I'm uh, wanting to bring you guys a brand new video tonight. Um, I'm actually really, really excited about um, showing you guys this resource. Uh, I've had a tremendous amount of emails and correspondence from subscribers asking where can I get insurance for my food business or even the question, uh, do I even need uh, insurance for my food business? And the answer is a huge yes, you do. Um, if you want to keep yourself protected on a, from a legal standpoint and you want to make sure that you've got yourself covered and your business is going to stay afloat, if you ever had any issues with uh, down the road, if you have any issues with someone getting sick or having some type of al allergic reaction to food or any of those types of things, you want to definitely make sure that insurance is something that you have. Uh, behind you to make sure that you uh, stay in business. <laughs> so uh, so the question that first right off the bat is, do I need insurance for a food business, even if I'm just reselling food and I'm not really making food? Yes, you do. It, it, basically, in the world of business in general, if you have a business, you need to have insurance. Um, and definitely uh, when you're working with food products or if you're preparing your own foods either from a home-based commercial uh, home-based kitchen from the cottage food laws or a commercial kitchen if you're working from a food cart if you're a caterer even if you have a food truck uh, or even food trailers or a concession you need to make sure that you have insurance uh, in case of the chance that someone could get sick or an ingredient that you have is expired and there's an issue with that so uh, let me just show you really quick this program is called the flipprogram.com uh, that's the food liability insurance program and I'm going to tell you something guys this is a very easy to use website uh, they have it set up extremely uh, user friendly uh, the platform is fantastic the interface is very easy to understand uh, you basically will pick out whatever type of coverage you will need um, this let me show you really quick this drop down menu that they have um, this here who we insure and it goes through a huge gamut and a huge selection of different types of types of food businesses uh, even the cottage food laws which I have a lot of videos on my channel about when you start from your home you can even get insurance for your home based food business uh, if you're going into farmers markets if you're getting into food manufacturing okay if you guys are, are making uh, products in a commercial facility on a larger scale uh, they even cover you for that um, if you're a food truck if you're an entrepreneur that wants to do a food truck uh, you want to definitely make sure you have as well. You've got yourself covered with some insurance. They even cover that. And down here, you click on uh, view more and they have even more uh, types of food businesses that they will cover. Um, now, their their program starts here as a as a uh, advertised for at two ninety nine per year. Um, it does go up from there, depending upon the type of actual policy that you will be written. Every policy is pretty much uh, specific to the type of business you'll have, but in general, the coverage they have is is a basic uh, coverage up front. and it depends upon what your needs or additional needs may be. And you can contact them. Let me get real quick. Here it is right on the top. You can contact them with any questions at that number right there. And of course, the website again, so you can take a look at it is flipprogram.com. And I'll put a little link. I'll put some information in the description down below so you guys can on your own time take more uh, more look into this website. And like I said, it's super easy to understand. You basically just can choose wherever you want to head to within the actual uh, website. And then go from there. Um, now, let me show you this really quick. This is something interesting. Uh, this is who qualifies and obviously who doesn't. Now, there are some forms of businesses that are related to the food industry, but they do not cover under their insurance that they uh, offer. And that would be this column here on the right. Of course, as it says, excluded lines of businesses. Um, and it would include the baby food, commercial farming, and, and so on and so on, alcoholic beverages and such. Um, grocery stores and supermarkets. Um, there are companies that, yes, they will offer insurance policies for these types on the right. Uh, but uh, specifically, the FLIP program is for um, smaller food businesses in general. If you're working again from a home, there are some exclusions in regards to the amount of product that you'll sell every year and the uh, dollar amount as well. Uh, but you've got a huge selection and the majority of my subscribers actually will fall into the category of accepted lines of businesses. 
Uh, most of you are producing food on a small scale or you're just starting from home. So you can definitely find a, uh, a category within these. And this is a vast category, guys. Just take a look at this. Even push carts, hot dog carts, food trailers, um, culinary businesses, and just literally goes on and on. Um, and if you guys want to speak directly to somebody, of course, they have uh, their uh, phone number here that you can contact them directly and or just email them. Um, if you've got questions about what does the policy cover, uh, another great thing, by the way, to keep in mind, they are licensed in all 50 states. Definitely want to have an insurance company who is licensed in every state. So that way you are good to go. No matter what state you're in, you can buy directly from them. And here really quick, this breaks it down. This will show you uh, their annual policies actually starting at $299. Um, that is extremely reasonable. And I can tell you firsthand, uh, when I bought my policy, uh, $299 to about $399 or so per year is, is very inexpensive. Um, and let's take a look really quick. Um, you know how I do not like to make really long videos. I want to get right to the point and get to the specifics. Um, let me show you the coverage details. Let me click on this and we will take a look really quick and I'll show you um, and explain to you what the coverage is. And it's coming up here in one second. So yeah, I've had a lot of requests um, in regards to um, having insurance. And like I said before, um, the idea that you, you know, the question even coming up, should I even have insurance? You know, hands down, when it comes to food businesses, you got to have yourself covered and protected um, because it could be a sticky situation if someone did have some issue with your food product, okay? And again, like I said before, um, even if you're just reselling, I have a lot of viewers too and subscribers who are uh, kind of resellers, uh, just buying products and flipping them online or selling products that they don't make at all, okay? But you're still in the business of selling food and that is the case. You do wanna make sure that you're covered and of course, find out which specific plan within the FLIP program will, would be adequate and would be sufficient for what it is that you're trying to do. So let me go over this really quick and show you the following limits apply to each FLIP policy. And again, um, like I mentioned really quick uh, before, this is going to be kind of a basic uh, starting point for your, for your policy. But please note that this is only a summary of the insurance coverage. Of course, all policy have specific terms and conditions, as I mentioned before. Um, each policy will, will have some more specifics based upon what type of policy you're going to need and what type of food business specifically you're in. So just keep that in mind. Um, and this is actually the, the same type of limitate limits that um, the food insurance uh, policy in general is going to have. So uh, general liability, you've got products, completed operations, aggregate limit. And then I want you, if you have any questions in regards to these specifically to get more details as to what they mean, um, definitely give Flip a call and their uh, customer service guys will be more than happy to assist you and explain to you exactly what that means. So again, it will be dependent upon the type of food business because if you're in a food truck situation, that's obviously different than you would have a commercial kitchen or um, a home-based food business. So this is it, and it's just uh, not, a, not a hugely um, uh, very uh, difficult concept to understand. It's you've got all of these to cover you. And then, of course, as your policy is written, you'll have a few more other specifics, and then they will show you that as well. Um, and you can even request that information before you get the policy itself. Um, just want to understand exactly uh, what is entailed with your policy. So guys, I hope this uh, answers some of your questions. And again, I just wanted to direct you to this resource. Um, this website is uh, very user friendly. Like I said, um, they're very easy to understand as far as what they offer. And this is one of the very few, if any, websites that bring together um, uh, the multitude of companies that they can actually cover you for within this categories, all these categories here. So if you guys have any questions, definitely contact uh, thefliptprogram.com and give them a call and, and you can uh, follow up with your questions with them. If you have any questions for me in regards to the Flip program, let me know down below in the description. Um, and again, I'll put some resource contact information uh, to help you guys out. And I bring you this resource because uh, it is so easy uh, to use and it's definitely something that you all need to have if you're getting into any type of food business. Uh, no matter what that might be. So if the video is helpful, guys, definitely, like I always, just give me a big thumbs up. I, I would appreciate the support. And I thank you guys for your subscribing. 
And I do hope that this information will definitely make it easier for you to locate and, and track down the insurance specifically that you need for your type of food business. Um, this brings it all together for you guys. Um, and let me really quick, I'm going to click on to the contact us. <clears throat> So within the website, once you get there, if you want to email them, you can simply just do it through here. And again, like I said, their interface uh, is so easy to use on the website. And then, of course, their phone number. And of course, again, in the description, I'll have all that contact information. So thank you guys very much. I hope this helped out. Take care.